study of black holes and the attempt to answer the very well-posed questions. I should say that the work done by Maldacena was pu purely mathematical. It wasn't framed in the study of black holes, although the questions ultimately uh, seem to be intimately related. So the study of black holes seems to be strongly suggesting that these ideas of holography, holographic universe, which came from a different region of physics, from trying to understand other things, those descriptions may be valid, may be in some sense true. And it seems that we're beginning to glimpse an answer, at least in very simplified models, and that the information is stored on the boundary redundantly, which means that you can lose a bit of it and still fully specify the physics of the interior. And it does seem that that's akin to or similar to the way that we will in the future encode information in the memory of quantum computers to protect them from errors. So I'm giving you an interpretation, which, and there will be other people who have different interpretations, but it does seem that